Hey, what's going on YouTube to all my subscribers? Your boy Fear 617 here. I just want to say Happy New Year's to all you guys out there on YouTube. You know, 2018 is here. And boy, you know, 2017 has been one hell of a roller coaster. You know, from Donald Trump as our president to, uh, you know, terrorist stories, you know, went on, you know, including the shooting in Las Vegas. Um, you know, rest in peace to YouTuber, the angry grandpa, and uh, also to uh, another story that made national headlines, um, 49ers quarterback Colin Koblick, yeah, I think I pronounced his last name, um, it, you know, taking a knee, you know, against the national anthem, like I said, you know, it's a whole lot of stories of 2017, you know, you know, it, it, it's mind-blowing. But now, it's a new year, you know, a new chapter. And I'm just, I'm, I can't wait to see what 2018 has in store for me. Oh, man. Um, I want to talk about this because everybody's now talking about this. And uh, YouTube sensation, Logan Paul, he is, he is in really in hot water. You know, not a good way to start off 2018. In case you guys have not heard the story, um, you know, Logan Paul, uh, he uh, posts out a video on his channel. I think it was yesterday, but he quickly took it down. What it was, um, him and his people, you know, they was in Japan. And... You know, he's, you know, he's doing, you know, vlogging, you know, blogging and all that. And, um, yeah, so him and his people, they in Japan. And uh, they was at this uh, forest called the Suicide Forest. So they was in the forest and um, they came across a dead body. A real human dead body. And, you know, they was filming it and they, um... I heard one part of the video, you know, they were staying right next to it. And, you know, they was like, you know, choking around a little bit and all that stuff. But I have not fully seen the video, but that's what other YouTubers were saying in their videos about this constant fushy video of his. So, ever since then, you know, he quickly, you know, deleted that video off of his page. But, you know, but, you know, the video stuff is still all over social media. And um, as for Logan Paul, you know, you know, I like his uh, blog videos, and I follow Logan Paul ever since 2016. You know, back in the summer, you know, when the Summer Olympic Games was going on, and that's when I started, you know, following Logan Paul. And I like, you know, you know, his videos ever since. You know, real funny dude. You know, he do sort of stream full stuff. You know, all these blog videos he puts out. You know, I like to entertain people, and. Um, this dude has like damn near what close to what 13 million subscribers on his channel. I think yeah, it's about that number, but he is a really huge YouTuber. And a man like that, you know, he has endorsements and sponsorships. But ever since he put he put he put that video out on his YouTube channel, you know, like I said, he is he is in really hot water, you know. Everybody, you know, is very upset and disappointed in him. And, um, you know, he, this guy, this, uh, he, he, you know, he has, he got a whole lot of backlashes. And, you know, everybody, you know, hate him for what he did. You know, it's, you know, um, you know, uh, for one thing, suicide ain't no joke. And this is like one of the main issues that, you know, we face in our lives. And... If you see or if you see any signs of that person that you know that their life is ain't going their way and they're thinking about taking their own lives, you know, please save that person's life because suicide, you know, is a very serious issue. And um, and as for Logan Paul, look, um, you know, you should not have posted that video if you know you're going to get a really huge backlash, you know, constant pushy. You know, if you're gonna 
if you know you're going to film that type of video, you know, you should not have posted on your YouTube channel at all. Because, you know, stuff like this, you know, dude, you can lose a lot of subscribers and um, you can lose sponsorships, endorsements, and also uh, that's one of YouTube uh, policy, you know, violation rules. Yeah, so, you know, I hope he learns a really huge lesson for that. And, you know, he, you know, like I say, you know, you know, I like look at his videos and he's a really funny dude. And he was like one of the YouTubers I would, I would love to collaborate in the future. But like I said, what he did, posted that video, you know, showing, you know, you know, that dead body, you know, that he found in uh, the suicide force in Japan. It, yeah, he is very wrong for that. He should not, he should never have posted that video up on his YouTube page. Yeah, so, um, and, um, and before I have to fail out, I will post two links in the description. One is his apology video, and another, you know, ABC News, you know, you know, you know, did a news story about this. You know, this video right here he posted out, it quickly deleted it. You know, this shit is national news now. So, and, you know, it's crazy. And like I said, he should never have posted that video up on his YouTube channel. Yeah, because you know, he gonna get really huge backlash and, you know, he could, yeah, he could jeopardize his, yeah, his YouTube career that way. Yeah, so, like I said, you know, you know, yeah, it's, it's very crazy. You know, uh, this should be a, a really huge lesson to him. And like I said, check out the links in the description of the news story and his apology video. And um, that's all I got to say. Uh, like, comment, and subscribe. And what do you think about this whole Logan Paul, you know, issue? Yeah, so... Like, comment, and subscribe. Till next time, your boy, Fusion for 7 saying peace out and happy New Year's, everybody.